because it's like the more you do what you want, then you can, you're going to, it's going to lead you to, you know, doing better. The more you do anything, the better you get at it. Right. And it also opens up options. Right. So it's like what I'm thinking and what I was thinking about as far as doing what you want to do, it's like you got to do what you want to do. You can't be feeling like, oh, I can't do what I want. So I'm going to just do whatever. Like, you know, what I do don't matter because I don't I can't do what I want to do anyway. When it's like, if that's the case, do what you need to do in order to in, until you can do what you want to do. Right. Because then if you're not doing that, then what you are doing is only is taking even more away than what it is that you want to do. Right. And then it makes it to where you end up needing to do what you don't want to do. In order to continue doing whatever it is that you're doing. That you allow yourself to get involved performing. You know, when it could take just angling yourself, it takes just that added approach to turn things in your favor, turn the odds in your favor. And it's always possible because everything is possible. So it's like, what are you going to do? What's the best action to take? Well, do to do what you want is going to be the most practical. It's going to be the most reasonable thing to do is what you are compelled to do as far as the best. There's like I said, there's other elements involved with the, you know, the quality. You know, we're talking about the best thing to do, but is you still want to have quality. You know, or rather, yeah, because, you know, it's hard to put your heart into something that wasn't your idea to begin with, that you didn't think of yourself. The starter, it's hard to put your heart in it. Why I say, and why do I say what I'm saying? As far as do what you want. Um, Because then, you know, we find ourselves, you know, obligated to include what is less or outside of our most most authentic, most personal, most personal interest. Uh, we start letting, you know, we start excusing ourselves for certain things. You know what I mean? We begin to make excuses for acting and behaving certain ways, you know, for uh, performing particular action, for, for even feeling certain ways about what it is that we're doing. It's like, once it's done, it's done, for one, you know, you didn't already did it, like I said before. So it's like, I didn't already did it now. So it's like, I might as well just Forget about it, you know. When there's a there's steps to take to retribute, retribute, you know. And that's always necessary because it's, it's happening either one way or the next, you know. And that is the switch. Also, it's like karma in itself. It's not. It's not always, for the most part, based on or depending upon the very action in itself so strictly or technically but more so why you did what you did you know or and and even in what you did and why you did it how you did it (laughs) um you know was it after you already realized that it's not really what you would prefer however it's in the direction towards building on what you would feel most passionate about, you know, because passion is important. You know what I mean? Passion is important. You know, it's like when you lose your passion for something, 
it, it, it turns in on you. It doesn't go anywhere. You know what I mean? It's not lost. It's not lost passion. It's just reverse passion. It's, you know what I mean? It, 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 the passion becomes poisonous. We are all, we all come to that decision before we come to that conclusion. You know, you're going to come to that decision to where you have a, you know, the opportunity, you have an opening, an opportunity, and you're equilibrializing to mix it up or fix it up, to mix it up or to fix it up. It's not, you know what I mean? And, and so to where just that much of your quantity will be even much more powerful, much more, you know what I mean? Impactful, much more significant, which it deserves to be because you are, you matter. Everybody matter, not just black, black lives. Good. And everything matters. Right. And who's to say that it don't or, or how much it does or where it doesn't. Right. Well, you are. To say, and you are saying in every choice that you choose instead of what you would choose. It happens, yes, but that don't mean it has to. It has to keep happening. It only is. It only is that way so that it can be on its way to wherever you want it to be, right? And if it's where you want it to be, then of course, then it's just going to be another place for others to come if they feel so compelled right but if it's but it, you know, it's still a place though you know what I'm talking about whether it's in motion or not which if it's alive it's gotta be moving but it could just be still circulating you understand as opposed to um fucking in, in inertia or whatever like okay right like I said if it's if it's one way, it's only one way in order to be on its way, is what I said, right? To what you, where you want it to be at, yes? But even whatever way it is, it's still a place. It is, right? Even if you're going somewhere, you're still in a place going somewhere, right? You're in your body going wherever the fuck you're going, right? And your body is in a car going wherever the fuck you're going, yes? You can't get nowhere without being somewhere, yes? You can't even travel without being in something. Unless it's your mind, cuz. Right, so that's the point I'm making and that's how I can say what I'm saying as far as a way something is, is a place. And even if it's not the way you want it to be, it's still on its way somewhere. And even in the place that it ends up being where you prefer it to be, which is mostly what you would want as opposed to just having to have it to be what's working. It's still moving, even though it's more settled, it's more centered, it's more centralized. It could be now, of course, like I said, situated. It could be activated, it can be acclimating. And its movement is now in a particular pattern that adds to a, a more, you feel me, you know, elaborate sort of design as opposed to it just being disarrayed and unconnected to the most quality fucking angles and fucking points of the spectrum, cuz. Yes, right, cuz you gotta be in something to move somewhere anyway. Right, so you, you at a place going to a place, no matter what, we on earth, Nigga stationary, nigga. The ground ain't moving, but nigga, the, the whole earth, the surface of the earth is is moving <laughs> with the earth. Yes, but the ground ain't spinning to where we dizzy. And that's the whole idea of those points, of the larger, the larger design. Yes. So we sitting here, you feel me? It, it take a minute every hour, it takes 60 minutes every hour in order to get to uh, the end of the day. Yes, to where it becomes, the, you feel me? The, the the second half to where it's now not even light no more, it's dark now, it's two, it's two ways in one day, right? And by the next day, then it's two different ways, but the same though, you know what I'm talking about? So even in that, it takes time. It's, there's always this element of performance involved. So the more you do, the more you see, you feel me? The 
more movement you're doing, I mean, the, you, you're, you're, the more action you're taking, the more action you take, the more you do, the more action you take. Of course, that's what you're doing. That's, that's when you're doing action, yes? You're actively performing activity, yes? You know what I mean? And whatever the activity is, how related it is to each other, minute by minute, you know what I'm saying? Because you, be, you can begin doing one thing and end up, by the end of the day, it being totally relevant to something you never even expected. Yes? You know what I'm saying? You start, you, you, especially if it's just, you know, just a random ass action, a random ass, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know what I mean? Whatever, just, you know what I mean? Just open, free, just, you know what I mean? You don't have to be, don't have to be important or whatever the fuck. You're just doing whatever it is you got time to do. If you got free time to do whatever you want to fucking do. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? And it's, it's like, if you know, if it's, it's like, that's gotta be what it is because somebody had free time to designate whatever it is you would be doing otherwise, yes? Somebody had the free time, nigga, to set, set up whatever's possible you would be doing other than what you would be doing with your free time, cuz. Right? Yes, better know that. It took free time. It took free time to think of work to give, motherfuckers. Niggas wasn't working when they thought of work to give other niggas, cuz. They was done with some work, maybe. Because like I said, activity bring you to the thought and the thought bring you to the decision or to the words. You know what I mean? Um, and that's real. That's just, that's just, the, that's the situation. And it's not even about, oh, you know, fucking just doing, not doing what you gotta do. It's like, okay, yeah. Just know though, you're contributing to a larger, to a larger fucking picture. You know what I mean? We got jobs out here, yo. But there's still people hungry, yo. On earth, yo. And how is that fair? It's not fair. It's food wasted. So what can change with shit, man? People gonna first of all have to feel a lot more nigga fulfilled in whatever they doing. For one. Right? It's like, oh, you gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, well look, man, you know that job that you got, the job that I got, I contribute to pollution. Right? I work for a manufacturing company. We got factories. We got, you know what I'm saying? We we got smoke emissions. We got, you know what I mean? We, we making a humongous carbon uh, fucking um, fingerprint on the earth. Yes? Yeah, I mean, I work in a cubicle. I'm an accountant, so I don't never, you know, touch no oil. I don't never touch no, you know what I mean? I don't never put no non-biodegradable waste product from the production activities in the earth myself you know what i'm saying our, our packaging i don't drive the, the the rubbish packaging from our items to a landfill in the middle of the ocean myself but i do allow them to pay me 12 dollars an hour to sit down and enable it to happen every day And it's not nothing that I would even want to do, nor is it really nothing that I need to fucking be doing. Except for, of course, I have to feed my family, yes. Is that necessary for me to feed my family? I guess because I ain't thought about it, yeah. Kind of. But I feel a way though about things because I'm not really f fulfilled and now I'm got a little more free time than I would have. And with that free time, I'm doing things I would never do.